Hey everybody. Uh, we need to do a little correction on our multi plus two chassis ground. So in the original video a few weeks ago, uh, you saw me connect up a six gauge wire there and uh, I've got a two aught wire here ready to replace that. So the main connections, the main DC connections are four aught and the American Boat and Yacht Council recommends that the case ground is no smaller than one times size down from the main circuit carrying conductor. So if you're using four aught for your main battery cable, then per ABYC, you should have two aught for the case ground. So I uh, just wanted to get this correction out there. Uh, this is still a tabletop demo and I'm learning as I go and sharing what I learned. So learning is accepting mistakes, and putting out the corrections. So again, uh, I now have a two watt cable crimped and ready for connection into my link distributor. The six gauge cable, it can go. Remember to put, in, put down your lug on the stud, washer, lock washer, nut, and get this to spec by the torque specs. I don't have a torque wrench, so just making a guess. And as always, have your electrical diagram reviewed by an electrical engineer or your Victron distributor. That's how I had this mistake corrected. So again, 4i going in to the multi plus two means no less than a two watt for the case ground. And just kind of as a mental note, I know that a four aught will not fit through that hole and hook onto the stud for the case ground in here. Uh, Explorers.life has a lot of videos uh, on this connection and they show it with the multi plus. That case ground is much easier to get to. It's not inside this casing like this one is. Uh, so just be mindful if you have a multi plus you can probably go all the way up to four out if you feel like you need to for your case ground. But with the multi plus two, if you've got the four out here, two watt does fit to the Lynx distributor, case ground situation corrected. We'll, we'll see you on the next one.